Hello guys, my name is Arun and welcome to my channel. This series is a series of tutorials on Fortran programming. Now in the last tutorial we saw how to define and uh, use string and str character string and string arrays. Okay, now in this tutorial this is a slight extension of it wherein uh, we'll, uh, I'll explain you guys as to how to print and use uh, you know single quotes and multiple quotes inside state inside statements and all. Now in Fortran what uh, by default uh, it allows the usage of both single quotes and, and double quotes uh, unanimously and in a, you can so you can kind of use them in a proper manner for instance let me just you know uh, comment this line we don't need this as of now okay so we just need uh, we need this this and uh, and this line okay we'll save this and also uh, we will need these we will the need these uh, lines so uh, let me just gr let me just group select them all and and i just uncomment the lines and uncomment the lines and similarly i group select them all and i you know uncomment the lines okay so the thing is if you want to uh, assign a string or a character to um, you know a variable to a character a character variable or a string variable you can use single quotes and double quotes like this for instance you can use single quotes uh, uh, and write characters inside or you can use double quotes to write inside okay you can use single quotes for string uh, strings as well as char uh, big characters and the same way you can use double quotes for the same purpose so it doesn't matter but the problem actually comes when you're using mix mix and matching single quotes for instance uh, for instance, if you guys look at this and if you guys you know uh, look at this 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 sentence, okay, I'll comment this out for a short period of time, okay. If you guys look at this this sentence, okay, I don't need uh, uh, will I get an error? Yeah, so I will just comment all these, okay. I will comment all these, yeah, okay. Now, if you guys look at these two sentences, what it says is that it just it just types my name is Arun written in single double quotes, and the second line prints my name is Arun written in single quotes. So uh, you are allowed to use you are allowed to mix mix quotes unanimously. Similarly, suppose if I were to define this character a equals x in sorry uh, x in double quotes, this again this again works. This again works, so no problem in that. This is just an uh, okay. I move the cursor. Alternate expression. As simple as that. This is just an alternate expression. Fine. Uh, so this won't throw any error at all. And now uh, these sentences are perfectly fine, just like how we did here. We can use single quotes and double quotes to enclose strings, no problem. But suppose I if I were to write this sentence. We have to write this sentence where it says he is my teacher he is my friend's teacher now the thing is if I say I'm using a, a single quote as an up a single quote as an apostrophe apostrophe so uh, if I were to write this entire thing in single quotes okay uh, it will uh, the genie or the, I mean the co compiler will throw me an error because if you guys notice the uh, string gets terminated here so to avoid that, what you have to do is that you have to write uh, everything in double quotes, okay? This this single quote double quote mix and mix and matching helps a lot. It helps a lot. For instance, if you guys look at the second this fourth sentence, okay? Now I am writing I am fine in double quotes inside an already quoted sentence, and this inside sentence outside sentence is written in inside single quotes. So the, I can write the in, inside sentence in double quotes. As per my wish. Similarly, uh, similarly, in this uh, in this sentence in this print statement over here, the entire statement is written in double quotes, whereas the inner part of it, I am fine, is written in the single quotes. As long as one quote is within sandwiched inside the other quote, uh, quote other type of quote, you are doing fine, nothing to worry. But there might be a condition wherein you have to. Uh, you have to include the, uh, both the both the contents inside the same kind of quotes. For instance, in this in this sentence, 
if I were to instead of this double quote if I were to use single quotes and all okay I'll get a warning like this I mean I'll get I'll get a non string character so this might be turn out to be problematic to to simplify that wh what Fortran does is that it has it allows you this ob uh, option called as double single quoting double single quoting so what it does is see in this part of the sentence I write them within double double quotes double double quotes thereby what this double double quote says is that it mentions okay I consider the next single quote double quote as a part as a quote and uh, d ignore this and ignore this when you come under string and string uh, issue you take this uh, do, do, uh, take this as a character and uh, go along with it without any error and all and uh, the same thing can be replicated with the single quotes here I have written everything all the entire sentence in a single quote and this part of the sentence in double single quotes and and yet again this also works pretty fine okay now if I were to you know print this all up okay I don't need any of these I just so I just comment this up okay I uh, comment this up okay yeah that will be fine now if I just uh, if I just compile this I'm just getting a lot of warnings because I haven't used any of these so let me just uh, comment this out okay I comment this out I just compile this f8 no problem f9 build it and f5 with execution and there you have it these parts get printed as it is without any issues and if you guys notice there is no difference between the usage of double quotes and single quotes here and the beside and also uh, in this sentence there is no difference there is no there is no difference in using the same suppose if I were to write this entire thing uh, write the entire thing in a different manner like suppose like double quotes like here and uh, single quotes here and single quotes here okay yeah, I just quit this up save this compile this build this and execute this it works just it works just fine okay except that since I put a double quotes here it's printing the double quotes here if you guys can see okay so other than that the mix double single quotes and double quotes can work unanimously fine and uh, this will be really helpful uh, uh, this will be really helpful if you guys you know want to put strings within other strings and printing like that uh, like that sort of stuff okay now that's all i have for you guys in this tutorial and uh, thank you guys for watching see you guys in the next tutorial in the next tutorials we look we'll jump into some other interesting topics which are which will be of uh, you know little more of greater use Okay, thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next tutorial. Bye.